Hey guys, Deb here with Art and Grace. Come on in. Happy hour Monday evening. Not really. It's not really happy hour. I just always say that because I do a lot of happy hours where I say that. So come on in. This is my portion for Craft Around the Clock. It's actually, I'm picking up for someone who's sick. So guys, I know you know so many people are sick right now. And um, anyway, you're going to see probably a lot of fill-ins like me. So if you were expecting somebody else, that's what happens is when people get sick, others will step in. So let me know where you're watching from. I'm getting this pulled up as fast as I can. Hello, Christy. How are you? Hi, Cheryl. I'm so glad y'all are popping in. Happy Monday. Did everybody have a good weekend? Feels like it's been forever since I've been here. Hello, Tony. Hi, Robin. Hi, Donna. Hi, Debbie. Hi, Allison and Barbara, Elizabeth. You guys came in fast. Hi, Tracy. Good. Awesome. Perfect. All right, guys. Um, if you are new to my page, you can go to the description of this video. It may be pinned at the bottom. I'm not even sure. Uh, but you can see all of the crafters one after another in Craft Around the Clock. So this is a group that has crafters just one after the other, almost 24 seven, it seems like. Um, I'm sure at night, you know, everybody's off, but there's always the replays. Thank you for spreading the grace, Debbie. Appreciate you. Hi, Sheila. Hi, Cynthia. I know some of you guys have had some hard days. I'm glad you're here anyway. We'll have a little fun. I'm gonna show you a cute little painting on one of my wood rounds. Um, I have already sealed it with the DecoArt multi-purpose sealer that will seal your wood so it's ready to go for painting. Hi, April. Glad you're here, my friend. Yay. Hi, Pamela. Hello, Tarita. You're watching. Oh, no. See, so many people are sick. I'm so sorry. Prayers for all of you guys who are sick. Hi, Brookie. Good to see you. Um, hello, Vicki and Valerie. Thank you for sprinkling, Valerie. Hi, Linda Sue. Listen, um, so many are sick, so just keep these people in your prayers. If you're per a person that does pray and you see one of those comments, would you mind just saying a prayer? Because you can just quickly, it doesn't have to be a long elaborate prayer, but pray for these ones you see. It can make all the difference, you know? And I love to know that we can count on each other for those things. Hello, Nelda. Hi, Louie. Oh, thank you, Luana, for sprinkling. I appreciate you so much. Thank you, Chris Castelli. Sparkle Chris Castelli, what a cute name. How fun. Okay, I'm gonna get started. Hi, Jerry. I just love seeing y'all come in and I wanna sit and talk. I don't wanna have to look away and all that. Hello, Zena, glad you're here. Thank you, Cynthia. Appreciate you sprinkling. If I have happened to miss somebody, I will go back. I'm, I have not done good on going back for my comments, but I really will. Um, I just always want to, but things keep getting, it's just getting to be that super busy time, you know. Um, thank you, Patty. How are you tonight? You're feel um, so, I am so glad too. I know you do so bad. Patty Melts needs our prayers every day. Um, sweet, sweet lady, sweet supporter of all of us, but she lives with chronic, very bad pain. And, you know, I, I can't even compare my back pain. It's got to be just nothing compared to what you deal with. Um, seriously so that's why i really hate to even complain I, I just really do because so many people have it so so much worse and that's why i say you know give grace you don't know what people are going through um say prayers when you see that somebody needs it just say it right then and there that's how we can help each other and i know they work okay guys we're getting on just a base coat and you can see how well it's going on since i've already got my sealer down if you don't have the DecoArt multi-purpose sealer, sometimes people will ask me, like, I can't find it, what should I use? You can use, like, Mod Podge. Um, it's, it's a sealer. It's a glue and a sealer, and it will work. There's nothing wrong with it. I used to use it, um, and it probably works just fine. You know, I know it does. I shouldn't say probably. It works okay. But the multi-purpose sealer has helped me so much like painting on all kind of surfaces. It's really improved the look of my art. So I'm totally a fan. And, um, you know, I am technically a deco art affiliate, but I don't, I don't ever show my link, share my links. I forget. It's in fact, we don't share links anymore. I forgot what they do now is we can give a discount code 
once every six months, which I need to do. I need to go find that code and, and give it to you guys. But my, my secret, what I do is I watch Michael's and it will go on sale and I can't remember their sale price, but I can get it for a dollar or a dollar ten. Um, so that's what I do. Pers I mean, I'm telling y'all, that's the secret. That's where you can get it for a buck, basically. Especially if you're over 55, they give you the 10% off if you're over 55. Does that jingling drive y'all crazy? Because I didn't even think about it until just this second. I was like, it's, I wonder if y'all are like, oh, let me know if that's loud for y'all. <laughs> oh, and I am wearing this cute apron. I got to show y'all. Let me take one second to show you. Uh, a friend of my daughter made this. I have never worn it because it's so pretty. But look, it's an A&M Aggie fabric seat. That's Reveille, our dog, um, school mascot. I just, this is the most beautiful thing. But I am wearing a new t-shirt that I don't want to get paint on. So I threw this on thinking, I don't know what's worse because I don't want to get paint on this. It's so pretty. But that's what it's for, you know. But you know how it is. You're like, well, the one the one Justin has, I've said before, like, oh, that's too pretty to paint in. And that's how I feel about this one. Although people are sweet and make us things for us to use. So I'm using it. Anyway, I had to take a second and show y'all. Okay, so we've got our base coat on. Because I've got that sealer on, you can tell one, one coat is going to do it. I don't have to do any more than one coat for my base, which is fantastic. Isn't it pretty, Patty? Thank you. I know Patty melts. Yes, April, can you believe I've never worn it? I don't think I've even shown y'all or shown Austin for sure. I mean, I don't know. It's just been hanging in here and I decided today I was gonna wear it. I'm gonna still be careful. I don't like to get paint on anything. So thank you. Hi, Linda Deaton, glad you're here. Thank you for spreading the grace and sweet Trisha. Trisha's so sweet and patient with me. I, she won Happy Mail, and I sent it, and I never heard back, but that's okay. I mean, I didn't expect to, really. I just figured, because we chit-chatted some, so I figured she'd probably say something, but she didn't. And then, today, she said something about it, and we realized it went to the wrong person, like, all together. I, it had her name and her address, except for the city and state which what I think happened was it populated and I clicked it to like yes that's right without really double checking and there was a the same street and number and everything in another location so that person got her happy meal but don't worry she's getting her her other ones on its way <laughs> thank you Vicki I love it too thank you so much oh Levada thank you for the stars how sweet appreciate it you're watching me and Justin tell Justin I said hi <laughs> He probably won't see. I almost gave up trying to comment on his feed because it is, you know how it is. He's got like, look at me with my sweet 80 friends and he's got like 500. So um, yeah, you, he cannot possibly see the comments. Okay, we're going to kind of get going because you know me and talking and, and I will kind of, you know, take too long and not get done. Okay, so what I'm going to draw <clears throat> on here, <coughs> excuse me, is an owl. I know this is, you're going to go, this doesn't look like an owl. No, it doesn't. It's a whimsical owl, okay? Now, I've painted some that are a little, a little more lifelike, but my style is whimsical and fun, not, not fine art, fun art. So, lots of us feel that way. <laughs> So now I've used this chalk pencil so I can kind of come back here and clean it up and just kind of, that's what I do. I just kind of, if I'm on paper, I'll keep erasing until I like the shape and that's pretty good. He's sitting on a little stump. That's the little stump here. And then we're going to put a little kind of Christmas tree here. So kind of make my, so now that we have our bearings, oh, let's do a hat. Let's do... like a winter toboggan so i that's how this is how i do it guys i mean it's just kind of you have to blur your eyes and kind of get the vision for it here let me just turn it toward me one second just one second so i can kind of get this going right oh okay 
I think we're good. Now, if we can bring this down into a toboggan, because I'm just loving those this year. I've painted several. Or you can just do the little hat and do a pom-pom. So y'all tell me, uh, we'll call this a trapper. You know, the kind that has the little flaps over the ears. Or toboggan. So y'all let me know what you want to see. But I'll start with the tree and get that going. Thank you guys for the little heart. Oh, thank you for the stars. Stars party, Vicki. Oh, yay. I haven't had one in so long. I'm so happy that Facebook's letting me have one. Hi, Tammy. How are you today? Glad you're here. Um, thank you, Lou Anna and Vicki. Hi, Vicki Gallagher and Tony McGee. I know what you mean. Yes, yeah, see, I've got to be more careful that I do everything in fast motion when it comes to stuff like that and just wasn't paying attention. Mary... Ocean Breeze and me, thank you so much for sprinkling. Y'all, I forgot what I was doing. Let me grab my round brush. I want to get this done, and, and I'm, I know if I don't hurry, I won't. Even though it's small, you know, these kind of things can end up taking, taking time. Because there's lots of, I do layers. I do lots of, you know, get this down, then go back and put something over it and all of that. Oh, Maria, I love that. It's so much more fun, you know? It's okay if you are the um, that perfect kind of painter. I mean, I admire people like that. Um, but when you do it whimsical and you enjoy it, then you're kind of like, okay, this is for me. So, you know, I'm just saying if you're not the perfect type, you don't want to have that stress then try this and and see if you like it thank you guys for the stars linda thank you so much hi dana maria liberty thank you for sprinkling appreciate it vicky your first time from indiana well welcome so glad you're here okay so i'm going to start at the top and we wait let me start yeah i'll start at the top and just kind of do this is going to be a whimsical little tree we're just going to kind of start doing our little letting the brush guys why don't i tell y'all every time you let the brush do the work so this is one of my three-sided handles that fits so well in your hand gives you good control and it is doing the work i'm just taking my hand y'all just watch how easy and just brush 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 just flicking flicking it so you can do this don't don't you dare say well you make it look easy but yes you can do it. guys I think April's still on here. If she is, let her know if y'all want to see my family paint with me. We'll do it. I'll make them do it this Christmas. We have to. We have to. They cannot avoid it forever. And it's been two years. It's time. So if y'all want to see them. Hi, Pat. <laughs> Glad you're here. Hey, Sherry. Thanks for being sweet to everybody. Hi, Deborah. Splash of paint. Glad you're here, girl. I know you're busy, too. Okay, so we're just getting these little motions in, and I'm trying to kind of go slow and let y'all see that it is simple, simple. This is a whimsical tree, so no need for perfection. Doesn't matter. Kind of, kind of coming back up the tree to see if I need to even it out. Now, you know, upside down, so it's not maybe fantastic here alexa's trying to talk i don't know what's going on i didn't say a word or touch her or anything okay not alexa but you know siri siri's doing her thing over here okay so we've got a base coat for our tree i'm not even going to wait for it to dry i'm just going to take that same brush not clean it off and go into my second color of green so i've got both on here and we're just going to kind of tap down tap tap and do the same thing all the way down I want these going kind of different ways. It doesn't, you know, they don't have to, I don't have to go over what I just did. No, I don't need you. I don't know why you're speaking. My iPad froze, so I may have to start looking at comments over here. Did y'all hear something? Alexa just spoke or whatever this thing's called. And I don't know why. I don't know what that was about. Okay, back to this. Um, so just tap, tap, tap with your brush, kind of going all the all the way down, all the places. But as you see, I'm not trying to go back on what I already did. I don't 
I'm not worried. I'm going fast. And I think a lot of people's problem comes in when they overthink and they're like, oh, I should have got that in between those two. No, it doesn't. You're just tap, tap, tap. And obviously I'm doing this upside down where I barely can see. So that tells you that it doesn't matter. You're just getting these on here and I'm just kind of doing the best I can to kind of see that it resembles a tree, you know, the shape of a tree. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and clean my brush off now. Y'all didn't hear anything, Tony? Okay. I'm so glad y'all are here. Yes. Okay. Y'all are saying, yes, we need to see them. Yes, I agree. Yes. Okay. Oh, um, Tony, I will have to send you my link so that you can get the right ones. It's these. I mean, I don't know. Um, you know, they're in my Amazon storefront, but they've got the three sides and these are also my, my favorite. I have to have both. So it's not one or the other. And I was doing my, I had like kind of a, you know, opening time for my private group over all of this Black Friday business that was going on. And okay, so I've got right here brown and like caramel color on my brush at the same time And I'm just kind of brushing that all going up. So it gives you kind of a blend So nothing fancy just a blend of those two colors And then I'm going to take a little more of the caramel color and kind of come around here and do the same kind of both get them on here but going this way so because the top of this little stump would be rounded like that. I'm kind of going that way with my strokes. So you can kind of see getting a little dark brown. So you can kind of see this thing starting to take shape, hopefully. Can y'all see that? Hello, Anna. I have been missing you. I hadn't seen you much lately. I know you're so busy with everything and yes you are live <laughs> hello I forget who I missed I thought I saw a name and then it went by Pam it was Pam thank you so much okay same with the owl I'm going to use kind of the same colors but I'm going to put out a little bit of tan and we're going to get him on here real quick so I'm really just loading up my brush with brown, caramel, and a little tan. So I've kind of triple loaded it, not any certain way. I'm just getting this brushed on here and I'm going to kind of go in the stroke that I want. So see how I want it to be up and down and kind of make this little shape. So I get all three colors on and just kind of get it on here. And I don't want to go over too much what I've done because see the streakiness and the different colors you see. So if I kept going over it, it would all become one color. So just kind of getting it on here. You guys have to let me know if you are done with Christmas shopping. Surely we're getting close, right? I'm pretty much done. And I've told y'all we cut back some and that helps. Helps with a lot of things. Helps with the stress of it and just, you know, grown people definitely have what they need for the most part. This is the year, honestly, we probably need to be given grocery gift cards and gas and all that. But, um, you know, when things are hard and times are hard, I feel like you have, you can't just keep on buying frivolous. You know what I mean? Like some of that's okay, but we cut back. Okay, so anywhere I might want some more darker brown, I'll put that. Um, let me get my, where's my brown? Waterloo, Iowa. Good afternoon or evening. And, ooh, Shelly, that's awesome. Aw, who said that? Thank you, Shelly, for singing. Please follow Deb. Listen, guys, I forget to say that, and I appreciate my friends who will ask you. Um, you know, if you haven't followed me, that would be fantastic. I would love to have you come by. You know, um, I do so many different things that if you don't enjoy one thing, just kind of hang out and see because I do glass art. I do 
Um, art is my favorite. Painting of all kind of whimsical things are my favorite. But I, I love glass art too. And we do just about everything. Crafts. I don't do a lot. Some of the things I do in my private group I don't do here. Like watercolor and different things. Okay, so there's the shape of our owl. We got him down. I'm going to take what is left on my brush and kind of bring it into the stump a little bit. And I probably will go back over that some, but for now, at least it gets some of it in there and right here on the bottom of that tree. So just kind of add in a little bit of the rest of that. Thank you, Dana, for sprinkling, you sweet lady. Working on Christmas cards, I did not get to do them. I thought about the other day how I'm, I just am not, and I started early. I don't have any excuse. I don't know. I just, did y'all decide on his hat? I didn't hear if anybody told me if they wanted to see the trapper or the, um, what do you call it? The little sweater cap toboggan. Let me go back and see if y'all said I don't see it. I don't see anybody, surely. Well, you're going to have to vote again. I don't see it. So, trapper hat that covers his ears or toboggan. Okay, so let's do... Hat would be cute red, of course. Let's get some red. I got white because I was thinking about a white trim, but then I thought, well, we might do the other kind. So I need to know what y'all want to see. Hello, Monica. Good to see Toboggan said Linda. And that's the first one I see. Toboggan it is. How are you, girl? I love seeing you guys come in. I always tell my my group members, you know, we got to check in with each other. Life is going at such a fast pace and so many things are happening. Um, not just, you know, in the world. Yes. I mean, we see these crazy things happen every day and here in Texas, we've had another tragedy with a child and, you know, we're just, things can change in the blink of an eye and we know this. And so, I always tell, in fact, we did it today. I put a post in there last night for today that was a check-in post. Like, we got to check in with each other. Be sure we're all doing okay. Somebody may need extra prayer, you know, having a hard time. And, uh, and just kind of some friendship. So, I, I really like getting in here and painting with you guys or whatever we do and just kind of checking in and seeing how everybody's doing. Okay, so we'll we'll do some more to this, but I need to let this dry while we move on to something else. So let's see how we're doing. You might try to make some coasters. Oh yeah, you absolutely. And that would be pretty easy. I mean, you could so do that. Yeah. Um, coasters are a great thing and you know people get tired of the ones they have so they're always ready for another set you know um, we do that you know there's nothing wrong with them you just kind of get tired of the same look and it's fun to get another so we'll put those away and get you something else or you can always gift it give it away oh I was just wondering if Y'all wanted to see a toboggan or one of those little hats that has the little flaps that come over his ears. I've been painting a lot of those this season. Y'all, did y'all happen to see the video I put up? I don't know where I put it, to be honest. Half the time when I go try to put up a reel, it comes out on my story. I probably pushed something wrong. I don't know. But anyway, it's somewhere out there. But I made this little video of all the things we've done so far for Christmas it is December the, is it the 6th? I've kind of lost track of the day. 7th? 5th? I don't know. Somewhere around there. And we've already done 50. We have done 50 paintings or crafts already for Christmas. That's a lot. So if you um, don't like this or, you know, you, you there's plenty of other things you can see. But I just, I had no idea we'd done that many. So you really have lots of ideas from me. I know that. Plus all the others and all the groups that you see. 
there's just a, an event going on all the time now. Um, wow. So you have all the inspiration you need. So some of you are going to have to take that inspiration and start doing, right? And when you paint something that I've taught, gosh, I'm just on cloud nine. So be sure and post it. Post it. Let us see it. Now here's our snow or the start of our snow. And while this is on my brush, I'm going to get a little bit more and start putting that on the tree. So we're just going to kind of watch how fast we're just putting it kind of on the tops of those branches. You know, I'm just kind of hitting the tops of the branches as snow would lay all the way down. You see how fast I'm going upside down. That's why I'm telling you it doesn't have to be perfect. You can all see that it looks like some snow on the tree, right? So don't overthink it. That's what we got. And already I see prayers going up for Pamela, which I love. You can come in here. You know, it's the 5th. Thanks, Dana. You can come in here on the 5th of December and have something going on and you will find someone to pray for you. Me, of course, but somebody else in these comments. I have the sweetest people on this page. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, that hurts. I, I can't. I can't my um, honestly my brain doesn't let me go there because I I see I cry it's like it's too much to Pamela we pray for you we sure do um, I will write you down and pray for you because that is um, that's just unthinkable as a mom I feel a gut punch for you right now um, okay let me huh y'all I haven't cried in a long time, have I, on here. Hold, please. Give me one sec. You know, we, we come on and we're happy. We want to we wanna bring y'all joy. And then um, knowing that somebody, a sister, you know, we may not know you, Pamela, but, um, but you know, it's just heartbreaking. And I... I used to, I, I've recently apologized for being sensitive, but yet, you know, I'm glad that some of us are sensitive like that because that's the people you know can really empathize and, and I guess just really hold you close because that is just so sad, so sad. Okay. But I love that we have a community that will be here in the good and the bad, you know. We we don't, we're not offered a, an easy life. I know that's for sure. Um, but man, with Jesus, we can get through even the things we think we can't. Now, my brown is not quite dry, so it's kind of turning a little tan. But for time's sake, I'm just going to kind of leave this be. And I might get out my dryer and dry a little bit. Oh, yes. We have a lot of friends on this page who have lost loved ones of, you know, all different. And um, you guys, I hope, can find a little bit of camaraderie and comfort from each other because I can't say I've lost a child and I can't, I just know how awful it would be. Um, but there are women on this page who can say I've been there and I hate that. But. Um, but I know some of them will, if you ever needed, you know, to just reach out, they'd be there for you. I have Dana. I sure have. I worked for somebody like that. It was really weird and very unnatural. I did not like the feeling of seeing somebody, especially a woman who, you know, just tend to be we tend to be the ones who are sensitive and yeah it was really strange oh patty had to get a ct on this one. Oh, that copd is so bad okay get that a little bit dry and let's go back and fix these eyes a little bit
and the eyes is one of those things that it that's going to take a couple of layers so i'll go on and start something else i'm going to give him a couple of little feet use this ochre thank you guys for being willing to share because you know sometimes it's hard to talk about but i see a couple of you saying you know i lost somebody thank you for being open and willing to comfort somebody else because it's not easy for you either so i'm just kind of y'all look it's like a upside down w in a way see like three little lines and you're you're good you're just doing little little owl feet little bird feet i mean it's a whimsical painting that's all you have to do i'm gonna take that same color and do a beak and i like to give my owls kind of funky beaks sometimes i do them long so i feel like that's kind of my how i always do them is long just everybody has something and on these whimsical paintings you can do crazy things and it's cute I'm going to take a little white and mix with this tan. <gasps> I see Arla. I've been thinking about you today. Hope that you're doing well. Um, always just waiting to hear how you're doing, girl. And kind of put a little bit of this in here. So you notice that whatever color, not just whatever, but you know, if I think it's going to go, I'll kind of add it in down here in the design or take that color and maybe, you know, give him a little, oh, let's do his eyebrows with that. So I just kind of come out here and start kind of between the eyes and kind of come out. And I'll have some. Let me get a little bit more. I'm afraid to look at the time. Time goes by so fast on here. It's like faster than normal. And I do like his eyebrows to be kind of wonky and kind of, you know, crazy like that. Now, remember, I'm upside down. It, of course, it could be better, but you get the idea. You get the idea. We're building, building him up. Let's do a little bit of that yellow for his eyelids. Oh. oh, Pamela, I'm still just, oh, I just, I'm so, just so sad for you, and um, you're going to be okay, you know, I hope that you'll come back and hang around, because I truly have the sweetest women on the internet that, that come here, and so you will be in good hands here. And if you see a business page on here, chances are they're the same kind of people. You know, I feel like um, a lot of the people who are who are here, they're just the same kind of sweet-hearted people. Not, I'm not saying I am, but I'm just saying I just have the sweetest people that watch. And so, if they are if they own a business, then they likely are. A sweet people too that you could follow and you know watch as well okay uh, that probably came out weird but anyway I'm gonna take that black since it's on my brush and come down here and kind of line my little log and that will give it definition to where you can tell this is the the curved part right so just kind of come along came along like that I'm gonna go ahead since I've got it here and I'm in a hurry and outline the body just a light a uh, quick little you know I really need a whole nother coat on his toboggan but we're just gonna go for it and then I'll put a few in this tree I knew that this might be longer than 45 minutes just because I do talk and do look at the comments and you know if I was just doing this by myself we could do it quickly 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 but that's what we have so far oh goodness 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 oh cynthia you're so sweet um okay now for his little feathers i'm just going to come in here with this brown and you can do this so many ways let's just do the easiest way i know i'll dip it in the brown and just start kind of 
uh, making little marks. I don't know any other way, but you're letting your little detail brush do the work. So I'm coming all around his eyes, kind of making these little marks, and then just kind of coming out from there and just kind of come down. This is just kind of your little whimsical buddy here. I think your kids would love to have this on the tree. But this is also a really cute little teacher gift. You could put her name on, you know, down here. Make more snow if you need to, to, to have room for it. I should have came around this one's eyes first because typically that's what I do. I take this and just kind of come around and have these going out and then the rest going down. And I just was kind of hurrying and didn't really do it right. But let's see, y'all still here? Hi, Arla. What the hoot? Is that an owl? I said something. I was trying to be clever, but I said, um, what did I say about it? It was corny. It was so corny. And I thought, I wonder if anybody will notice that. I can't remember what I said, but it was something similar. Like, I don't know. Who's coming? I don't, I don't remember what I said, but anyway, I was trying to be funny, but was silly wasn't really funny anyway you can just kind of add your little feathers however you want to and then I'll come with another color I always do at least a couple of colors and get some of this caramel in here at least on part of him or something uh, oh I let me finish that I so we'll just kind of put in uh, like a big dot and a little. That black's not dry yet, so I typically wait for that to dry before I do this little eye. Oh, goodness. Seven minutes. Excuse me. I think we're doing pretty good, though. I just wanted to do more to the toboggan. Oh, Vicki. You see, you too, and, and each holiday, I know each holiday is hard. It's, I think you just get, from what it seems, from what other people say, it. you just learn to go on, you learn to appreciate what you do have and the family that you do have, but it's, you know, we know it's not ever gonna be okay or, or normal. It's not normal, it's absolutely not normal. And I was thinking about that, how this family who's lost the little girl, the little seven-year-old near us, um, you know, this is, I, I thought to myself, this is their new normal, which is so abnormal. It's, that's why people say they can't get over it because it's so not how it's supposed to be. You know, we've taken what God wanted us to do and we've gone our own way and there's so much evil in this world. It's like rampant that, you know, that this is not our home and this is not how it should be. And things will be restored one day and people will face their judgment for sure. But, you know, we, we, are, we can't avoid the pain here. We just can't, that's how it is. And so that's why it's so important to have your people that will have your back and lift you up in prayer because that's the only way to get through it. Okay, so we've what I've done was I added a little more white, got it wet with the white, and then added a little blue to kind of make it look like, you know, little hills or little ridges in the snow. We've got our little tree. We've got our little owl. Let's kind of do something to his hat. So, um, little bit more red, and then we'll add some polka dots or something, stripes. Maybe polka dots just for sake of time. And then I wish I had a pom-pom. I know I've got some, but I don't have any handy unless I've like dropped one nearby. But let's see. I just cleaned this. I cleaned up so much stuff yesterday and put everything back where it went. So I don't have any little goodies sitting around like I usually do. Um, Yes, me too, Shelly. It is so senseless. Okay, let's do some polka dots real quick. Um, 
Let's do some green. I'm going to use that Kelly green and then we'll do some white too. Just using the back of my brush and dotting some of this on. Yeah. Isn't that, where, who said that, Brooke? Thank God this isn't our home. It is so true. And here's the thing, y'all. It seems like forever, especially for Pamela and you guys who have lost a child, it must seem like forever before you're going to get to see them again. But let me tell you, it's going to be so fast. It really... Um, this this life is so short in comparison to eternity. It's like a blink in comparison to eternity. So if you're a believer, um, you know, we have that. We have that to look forward to and, and to, to understand that, you know, this is, we're passing through. And I hope we can take as many people with us as we can. Um, you know, and that's another reason that we need to be urgent about telling people about Jesus and what he's done for us because not everybody has, you know, a long time. We just don't know. I'm going to do a little pom-pom and I guess I should do red. I started to do a different color, but that red, I don't know. I might add, I just think it needs something more vibrant. I think I might add a little pom-pom, a real pom-pom is what I'm thinking. If, if, if anybody's ever watching this, I say something that you disagree with or that you want to know more about, please message me. Please message me. Because sometimes as we're live, we might say something that came out wrong or that, you know, I don't know. I just would never want to uh, offend anybody or confuse them. So if you, if you need to chit chat with me, please do. Please message me. Okay, so there's our little, oh, that pom-pom's cute. Now that's okay. What do y'all think? I have more time. I still have two more minutes. Oh, good. Y'all like it? Let me see if you're saying anything. Is there anything that... Um, hi, Roxanne. You did. I'm glad. Thank you, Shelly Ann. I see your five minutes. Okay. That was a while, but still. Let's see. Then I just kind of look it over. Like, we could add some glitter. We could add diamond dust to the snow. That would be pretty. Let's do it. I usually use, um, one second, let me get back situated. Thank you. I'm glad y'all like it. Thanks, Dana. Thank you, Linda. Oh, Pamela, um, I'll private message you. You'll just have to watch for it. Like if you're not friends on Facebook, it, it goes to some weird place. Like you have to approve it. So I can message you after this. Um, but I'm going to take a brush and get some of this Mod Podge on here and just kind of go right over what I just did. Even though it's not quite dry, it'll be okay. And we'll get this down here. And then we'll add some, some uh, glitter. Put something to catch it. Actually, if you do it right away, you won't have a lot of fall off. Put it in one of these little containers of some kind. And I hardly ever have to put any back. It just almost all sticks to wherever I'm putting it. Oh, it's going to be cute with that snow. Oh, look at the glitter. Can y'all see that? Oh, it looks so cute. Okay, y'all, that would be another cute kit now that I'm seeing the glitter. Oh, I like it. What do y'all think? <laughs> cute, cute so easy y'all can do this so don't say you can't do it i'm telling you you can do this you wa oh i just stuck my fingers in it but it's okay it's okay you watched how we did just thunk, 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 just down the tree with our little strokes we colored that in and then we went down with our little feathers circles for eyes triangle for the nose the cap simple is how about I give this to you guys as a tracer for this month every month I put a free tracer on my website and it dawned on me that I haven't done it yet so I'll do that tonight I'll put it on there and y'all go get it 
um, my website should be pinned here at the bottom. I th yeah, it is. Do y'all see the pin? Because I can see it. So I'll give y'all that tracer. Um, Cynthia, let me send you some. Unless you need a whole thing. But I'm going to send. So if anybody wants the kit for this, it comes with the little round. Ooh, my time's up. The little round, the paint, the diamond dust, everything. So I'll get this on my website sometime tonight. Guys, thank you for being here. Thank you for praying for Pamela and all the others that were on this feed. And if you come along and watch this as a replay and you need prayer, leave it below, okay? I love you guys. I'm glad you were here and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.